weed just now that it could have been prevented. It's been almost three years since Gabriella and Victoria lost their father in the line of duty. Tacoma officer Reginald Jake Gutierrez. Years later, we're still left with questions that should have been answered from the get-go. The sisters filed a lawsuit against the city of Tacoma. They say they want to hold the city and the police department accountable for the wrongful death of their father. We're going to be affected by it forever regardless, so might as well try and get answers while we're being affected by it directly. Gutierrez was shot and killed while responding to a domestic violence call on November 30th, 2016. Officials say Gutierrez's killer was Bruce Johnson. First off, you'll see a warrant of arrest. Family attorney Lauren Cochran says Johnson was stopped by Tacoma police for his hostile behavior and impersonating an officer at the Tacoma Mall just 15 days before Officer Gutierrez was killed. Still, Cochran raises concerns about communication. Despite the fact that this officer's safety notice was active, despite the fact that there was an active arrest warrant, no one from the Tacoma Police Department told Officer Jake Gutierrez of these dangerous situations and of the dangerous situation involving Bruce Johnson on November 30th. Now his daughters want answers from the city he served for 17 years. Our dad would stop at nothing if one of us had something happen to us. So we are doing that for our dad because he's He's with us still.